AJ Sports with Peter Terpstra. So believe it or not, it's basically basketball season. Yeah. Let's recap the last six months or so for Penn State. Penn State was set to make the NCAA tournament for the first time in a long time, and then COVID canceled everything. He entered quarantine. Then one month before the next season, Coach Pat Chambers resigns after an internal investigation. Now, assistant coach Jim Ferry takes over the Nittany Lions for this upcoming season, and the players are just trying to wrap their heads around everything. I still have the privilege um, to talk to Coach. I just talked to him today, and I think that's the most important thing about all of this is that he still wants to be there for me. Uh, he's been like a father figure in my life. It's just like a loss of words, like confused, not understanding, just the reason, trying to see why the reason why he's not coaching with us, why did he get fired instead, why did he step down, everything like this. No, I'm not at peace with it, and I – Will not be at peace with it until um, everybody has answers on to why. But that is all I have on the on the subject. Penn State opens the season next Wednesday at home against Drexel. Now, one more basketball note: former Penn State forward Lamar Stevens hopes to hear his name in the NBA draft tonight. The draft starts at 8 p.m. You can watch it on ESPN. Some folks have Stevens placed as a second round draft pick and as you probably know he's one of the best players to ever play at Penn State on the